After water, concrete is the single most widely used material in the world, and it is more and more widely used along coastal zones. Yet, it represents a real threat to the environment. In Israel, two marine biologists found a novel solution to address the issue. Sanded concrete, the, the, the one that is, usually, that is used for most coastal construction, is made of cement, sand, and aggregate, and different chemicals that are added into the, into the mix for different reasons, for uh, freeze and thaw resistance, for anti-cracking, for better workability. Uh, those components are leaching out from the concrete uh, during a very long period after the concrete is deployed and affecting dramatically the biology that sits on it. Uh, with our technology, with our ad mix, it's, a, it's a, a powder that we add into the concrete mix. The cities of New York, Hong Kong, Rotterdam and even Monaco have adopted the concrete produced by E-Concrete that reproduces the shape of corals. People are understanding that climate change is here and now in our cities, in our coastlines and they are feeling the impact of the extreme weather events and sea level rise on an everyday basis. And that's what started driving the need in building higher defenses, putting more concrete in the water to protect the coastlines, and also realizing that we need to, to save those pristine communities, those marine environments, and also the life that grows with on these structures, we can actually harness it to make the structure stronger. This eco-concrete is 2 to 10% more expensive than the regular concrete, but the benefits for the environment are priceless. And what we saw was, for example, in Brooklyn Bridge Park, which was the first installation that we did in the US, uh, that we got double the amount of species. We got crabs, for example, a certain species that was not spotted in the area for over five years, and they were inside the pools. We saw larvae of little fish that are inside our little tide pools and nothing around it. So when we check the rock in the same elevation, quite similar to here in Jaffa. The startup was founded in 2012 and already has offices in Europe and in the United States, but the R&D division remains in Israel. Israel is a great platform for uh, testing marine biology because we have both temperate water and tropical water in a lot, so we can run a lot of experiments. This year, E-Concrete won the Green Tech Award and now wants to collaborate with major key players of the industry, engineers, and decision makers. Their goal is to see their eco-concrete used in all major coastal zone projects.